Changes in eyesight are one of the most common and expected sensory changes related to age. According to a recent study by the University of Michigan Kellogg Eye Center, 40.5 million Medicare beneficiaries reported using eyeglasses in 2015. That was 92% of the total number of people 65 years and older who were enrolled in Medicare that year. Vision is one of the first sensory systems that we notice age-related changes in. As we age, structural changes to the eye, particularly with the lens of the eye, can cause visual issues. These issues include increased difficulty adjusting to changes in illumination or light. For example, moving from a darkened theater to daylight outside requires our ability to adjust to rapidly changing levels of light. This takes more time as we get older, and it may contribute to driving difficulties when the driver must adjust after being faced with the headlights of an oncoming car. With normal vision, the lens of the eye changes shape to focus on objects at various distances. In someone experiencing age-related presbyopia, aging has caused the lens to harden. This makes it difficult for it to change shape to focus on objects that are close up. Although this difficulty can be corrected with glasses, contacts, or laser surgery, older adults may have additional difficulties that a corrective lens cannot fix. For example, as we age, it takes us longer to change our focus from looking at something that is close up to looking at something that is farther away. Presbyopia can cause difficulties for older drivers. Drivers need to constantly switch attention from their instrument panel or GPS directly in front of them to other vehicles and traffic signals located at varying distances away from them. This may cause difficulties because it may take older drivers longer to make that adjustment from focusing on an object that is close up to focusing on an object that's farther away. In familiar driving conditions and locations, this might not be an issue but the increased time to adjust may be problematic in hazardous driving conditions or when driving in unfamiliar locations that require more focus or more switching. For example, when driving in an unfamiliar location, people are more likely to rely on their GPS for navigation and that will require them to continuously switch their focus from close up to farther away. Although not necessarily a normal part of aging, abnormal structural changes to the eye, such as cataracts, cause visual impairments for many older adults. Cataracts develop when the lens of the eye, which is normally clear, begins to cloud. This can resemble a frosty or a fogged up window. The issue with this is that it limits the amount of light that is able to reach the back of the eye. Thankfully, cataracts can be surgically treated by replacing the cloudy lens and inserting a corrective lens. Another visual disease that becomes more common with increased age is glaucoma. Glaucoma occurs when the eye doesn't drain properly. This causes pressure to build up in the eye, damaging the optic nerves that carry visual signals to the brain. This image shows the visual changes associated with progressive glaucoma. This disease is relatively common in mid to late life and can generally be treated with eye drops. Our visual acuity, or ability to see clearly, relies on multiple components, one of which is the ability for visual receptors located in the back of our eyes to receive light and information from the environment. These receptors, also known as rods and cones, are spread throughout the retina of the eye. However, they are packed more closely in the fovea of the eye. The fovea is located at the center of the macula. With increased age, the probability of degeneration or damage to the rods and cones located in the macula of the retina increases. This can lead to age-related macular degeneration, a disease that results in the progressive and irreversible destruction of visual receptors in the macula of the eye. There are two forms of this disease, wet and dry. This disease results in the loss of the ability to see details. Reading and watching television become progressively difficult for individuals living with this disease. Wet macular degeneration can be treated to stop the growth of blood vessels that cause the disease. Unfortunately, there are not currently any effective treatments for dry macular degeneration. One of the biggest concerns related to declines in vision in older adulthood is the lack of insurance coverage for those who need corrective lenses. Traditional Medicare does not generally pay for vision screenings, eye exams, glasses, or contacts. However, it will pay for diagnosis and treatment of chronic eye conditions such as cataracts or glaucoma. 
For individuals living with diabetes, Medicare will cover the cost of an annual eye exam to check for issues related to their condition. Unfortunately, a lack of insurance coverage and financial constraints mean that a substantial portion of older adults are in need of corrective lenses and have difficulty affording them. This can lead to an increased risk of falls, car accidents, and other health risks. If you are interested in learning more, you can get started with the following resources.